All things considered, 2020 was a very different year. This was a year we didn't come back from spring break to make that final stretch run toward graduation. It was the year of empty classrooms and vacant school buildings and online conferences on Zoom. It was the year we learned about a new type of human interaction. We called it social distancing. Welcome to the new era of learning. As teachers, we thrive on interacting with our students, but as we entered the second decade of the new millennium, our lives and our careers were altered in ways that we could have never imagined. Who could have predicted that in September of 2019, a virus would shut down the district's computer systems and force teachers to instruct the old-fashioned way, using methods that involved textbooks and pencils and paper with no access to online services. A few months later, a global pandemic would shut down economies across the world and force schools to close their doors. Teachers found themselves looking at classrooms void of students, while an entire society remained quarantined to their homes. There's an old axiom that says you never really know what you have until it's gone. That is more true today than ever before. There's something about stillness that brings clarity to the cosmos. Our world today may be the most still it has ever been. And yet, rather than perceive this crisis as hardship, teachers everywhere are coming together and discovering new ways to bring hope and optimism to the very individuals that lured us into this magnificent profession, our students. A gift wrap package is passed through the ranks, and yet it is much more than just a package wrapped in colorful paper. It is a gift that represents the future. It holds all the hopes, dreams, and ambitions of future generations. It is a symbol of the uncertain and difficult times of the year 2020, and yet it gives us a reason to understand and comprehend why. This gift will not diminish in time. It will be with us forever. Each principal, each teacher, will pass this gift on to another, and another, and another. Every time it changes hands, we become stronger, more resolute, more unshakable, more steadfast. These seeds are a symbol. They represent our students hungry for water, nourishment, and care. As teachers, we plant the seeds, we cultivate them, and we watch them grow. Without your care and encouragement, the seeds would stagnate in the ground. As a tree responds to care, so do our students. The year 2020 will never be forgotten. For some of us, it will mark a new beginning. This tree and the accompanying plaque will forever be reminders that we made it through this crisis. When the orders from the statewide quarantine came down from the governor's office a little more than a month ago, I was concerned on how we were going to continue instructing our students. Distance learning was new to many of you you have adapted, stayed connected to students and parents. This has been a challenging year. As we seek signs of hope and return to normalcy, I just want to thank each of you for your diligence. As this tree receives nourishment and care, your students receive the same from you. This tree will always be a reminder of the challenges we overcame in 2020. Thank you for all you do. Teachers are the glue that holds all of this together. Without the work that you do, our schools would be nothing more than big daycare centers. It's teachers like you that give all of us hope for the future. Thanks for teaching and training tomorrow's generation of leaders. Who will form the backbone of a new workforce. That will lead us into a new era of service. Orienting careers and professions that will change the world. In ways that we never imagined. That you have not let today's circumstances. Stop you from having an impact on your students. The dedication and commitment you have shown over the last few weeks has made us all stronger. We've been through a lot this year, and now we just want to say, Thank you, teachers. It's been a challenge, but you are the reason we're succeeding.